Living in Pakistan as a Christian is quite difficult actually. But we are born here and uh, I mean we need to live here, we have no more options. But for the persecution, it's actually very hard. There are laws which are against us. I know many close per friends who are caught in the, these acts and they are in prison or even facing death penalty. Some people are just killed because of these laws. And uh, many person trying to go out of Pakistan. But actually, you know, these extremists feel that we are not related to Pakistan, we are related to West, to America, UK, but actually it's not. We are born in Pakistan, we should, we should have full rights there. In 2013, I did uh, CPM course with World Outreach, then my vision started to clear somewhat and I started CPM in Pakistan, but I was still doing only for the Christians. But last year I did nations course here, then my vision got clear that God wants me to do outreach. And then I started uh, outreach in Christian areas, I mean to Hindus. And then I feel, oh yes, this is the ministry God wants me to do and I got satisfaction in this. for my future dreams I never set high goals because I don't know how long I can continue this but I want to knock that door which is never knocked in a proper way and you know when I am knocking the door when this door will open this door can open even with a sword and uh, maybe I feel that uh, I, uh, I can be killed, I can go in prison anytime. So I don't set high target that I will convert thousand Christian and uh, do this, 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 set up big churches. But I am just, as, you, as I said, that I am following Christ. What he is saying to me to do and I am doing this. I mean, you need to pray for us, for our security, especially as I am doing ministry in a very restricted area. Anything, anytime, anything can happen. And uh, pray for my family. And I also need sources. I mean, going there, cost. And uh, also, I work for the persecuted ministry. They, we need sources for them. And most important is pray for security of myself, my family. I have four little kids, lovely family. So, yes. As I said earlier that it's a God's work. It's not my work, your work or world outreach work or any organization work. God has said us to go to the nations. So, if you feel your call, then you need to follow your call. Then uh, means sometimes you feel God is saying to you, go Africa, go here, here. Then you need to obey that call and don't try to be, okay God, I, am a mis I want to be a missionary, but I want to be here. Then you will not get any fruit. Just obey God where He wants to, you to be. Remember me in your prayers that uh, I fulfill the will of God and God has given me a vision to work in this nation which is very restricted nations. I will face persecution but man I promise you I will do until I am living and I will do with it with my heart and even this persecution of will overcome me but I will obey God according to his will.